Um, Philip was saying, just a, a really straightforward horse, but with so much more to offer. And I guess you share those sentiments. Yeah, he's um, he's, he's, he's quite a weak horse, you know, and uh, it's uh, that's why we haven't put another run into him from when he's maiden and he's a very very sensible horse and he's you see he stuck his head out and he, he really wants it you know that that must be quite a gamble for a trainer because you know the horse has got talent you know he's got a good temperament but as you say he's quite a weak horse putting him into a test that he couldn't really handle could send him the wrong way very quickly couldn't it yeah you have to be very careful and um, but he, he, he's such a sensible horse you know he's, um, he eats and sleeps and you know his work has been you know the last sort of 10 days his work has been great you know and are he and Bogart similar characters at all? Do they share characteristics you'd expect half brothers to? They're like two peas in a pod. Are they really? Yeah, unbelievable, you know, the temperaments and uh, <laughs> and the board. Like he was a raw horse last year, and this horse is, is quite a raw horse still, you know. Um, I think Bogart probably had a bit more strength by this time of the year, whereas this horse is going to develop an awful lot. Now, obviously, Phil thinks mm. Tiddlywings has the best chance of the of the Ryan runners in the in the Nunthorpe. Now he's safely tucked round the corner. You can you can tell us which one you think's got the best chance. They're, they're the three good horses, you know. Um, Tiddlywinks loves it here. Uh, Masama, he, he's coming right back to his best. And uh, Bogart, he ran very well here uh, in the Duke of York. And I'm, you know, I know he's been a touch disappointing since, but um, I'm hoping this track might bring, the, bring him back to his best. But uh, I couldn't be happier with the form of the three horses coming into the race. And they're all good horses in their own right, and I, 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 I just hope they all run the race. And given that two of them get six pretty well, I'm guessing that that little bit of rain won't have damaged your chances. No, and um, you know I think it'll be a fairly strong pace here. And uh, you know I'd say Tiddlywinks will be doing his best work in the last furlong. Let's hope that he's, he's close enough to, to do it. You know, Kevin, it's already been a tremendous week. That would be some icing on the cake. Thanks so much for talking to us. Well done. Thank you.